mbaya mbaya samaki utampa mtoto huwezi kupa chakula mbaya haina kemiko matunda asilia yanatoka shamba atumii dawa kama tunatumia ni chakula inayo kutengeneza mwili katika mfumo mzuri unaweza kukaa kawa mnene lakini hauna matatizo unakaa fit zaidi mimi naelewa kwamba lishe bora inakujenga wewe mwenyewe kwanza binafsi acha wenzako wewe mwenyewe binafsi kama unakula lishe bora basi itakutengenezea mazingira mazuri kwa hiyo ukisema masuala ya nyama si kama sio tu hapana tuelewi sawa sawa kabisa masuala ya nyama Nutrition is the backbone upon which national agriculture and food security investment plans should revolve. It is now my pleasure to declare that the Cardiff Agriculture and Nutrition Capacity Development Workshop here in Dar Salaam now is now officially opened. Key developmental stakeholders met in the Tanzanian commercial city Dar es Salaam from February 25th to March 1st 2013 to discuss concrete actions needed to facilitate nutrition security through improved agricultural practices in Africa. The new partnership for Africa's development NEPAD through its flagship program the Comprehensive Africa Agriculture Development Program CADIP in collaboration with Tanzanian government recently held discussion with representative from regional economic committees REC the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and other development partners at a special workshop on the Eastern Central Africa Regional CADIP nutrition program the Tanzania Agricultural Food Security Investment Plan TAFSIP, was developed and launched on the 11th November 2011. That brings all stakeholders in the agricultural sector to a common agenda of comprehensively transforming the sector to achieve food and nutrition security, create wealth, and reduce poverty. The workshop was held amid concerns that several countries that committed to accomplishing the Millennium Development Goals set to eradicate extreme poverty and hunger, MDG1, were still not on track to doing so, and poverty targets were making little or no progress. Out of this workshop, uh, we expect, you know, countries and even development partners and other stakeholders to do business differently. Uh, because coming from this workshop, the investment plans as revised will help countries, member states to mobilize resources from within the national coffers, but also to mobilize resources from development partners. The good news is, as we heard this week, is that uh, there actually is money, you know, that can be channeled for nutrition programming and for nutrition projects at country level. So we believe that, you know, since we'll have better plans and uh, better instruments with good proposals, we indeed can harness resources to implement nutrition better. The agents for increased momentum to achieving this and other MDG goals, therefore, were being intensified as the 2015 deadline approaches. The meeting worked around the theme, building capacity to mainstream nutrition in national agriculture and food security investment plans in Africa, brought together a range of participants from 18 countries versed in nutritional issues, including Cardiff country focal points and delegates from ministries Ministries of Agriculture, Health, Education, Finance, Civil Society and Private Sector. As a private partnership member, for, for the industry it's usually very simple. Any strategy which is developed and agreed upon, roll it out. For us it's usually as simple as that. Just roll it out. Put it in the public domain. Let us take it and run with it as an industry. Euh, nous comprenons que euh, pour un franc que nous dépensons pour, pour la santé, c'est-à-dire pour, pour la nutrition, nous pouvons en gagner plus. Parce que euh, la santé, quand il n'y a, a, a pas la bonne nutrition, il n'y a pas la santé. Et donc dans ce cadre, euh, j'y verrai personnellement et que euh, pour que le gouvernement... Le gouvernement euh, prennent conscience de ce très important dossier et que au niveau de l'Assemblée qu'un plaidoyer soit fait pour qu'une qu enveloppe euh, 
conséquentes soient allouées pour ce secteur. Pour ces pays qui ont encore développé leurs investissements, c'est une opportunité pour intégrer l'intégration de la nutrition intensive des stratégies et des activités dans ces pays pour que dans le futur plus proche, nous puissions avoir a better um, uh, nutrition indicators, uh, better nutrition levels in the member state countries. Uh, in Ethiopia, we have uh, developed a strategy called the school health and nutrition strategy. Basically, it means all teachers will be educated to deliver uh, nutrition education in the schools, uh, have the schools uh, prepare ready and able children and uh, adolescents for equipped with life skill, uh, lifestyle skills and knowledge about what to eat and what choices to make in, uh, to be healthy as well as to be productive. So in schools we will also have a proper water and sanitation as well as school gardens so that they promote and educate other communities at rural areas as well as uh, in urban areas. So we are going to go back with recommendations from this workshop and uh, we are hoping to identify particular sections of uh, enhancing nutrition in agriculture for the purpose of improving the nutrition well-being of our vulnerable people in Uganda. The common objective was to address the challenges of malnutrition and exploring how best to coordinate efforts to effectively deliver nutrition services where they are not most needed. The issues of nutrition were not adequately addressed. And here came a challenge from our side as a country to bring them on board by consulting different stakeholders and our main stakeholder was the Minister of Health and uh, uh, Social Services and then we consulted the TFNC so that we can bring on board the issues which have been addressed in the uh, uh, strategic plan. M many people eat ugali but uh, you don't know if eating ugali every day can bring in issues of nutrition by itself. So we feel, felt in that uh, by being addressed as a country with a, a huge malnutrition and the other uh, vitamin A deficiencies, we felt that growing vegetables, for example, cooking well, storing them well, and also food fortification are issues which can be taken on board by not only the Ministry of Health, but the Minister of Agriculture is the key, key cornerstone towards producing them. And also we have got um, a full-fledged department which is responsible for processing and the other milestones during storage. So we felt that uh, let them be brought in the structure and the ministerial arena so that we can take them on board. To ensure sustainability of anticipated outcomes of deliberations reached by the special workshop, the main facilitators who contributed over half the cost of the workshop's budget, Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and Development Partners, had highest expectations of the resolutions by the workshop. The agricultural sector is traditionally just focused on production, but it's very important that it also focuses on food consumption and nutrition. This workshop we're happy to support because we strongly support the country-led CADAP process and we want to strengthen African institutions like NAPAD. It's important at this workshop to bring together diverse stakeholders from many different sectors because they usually don't have the chance to get together within their own countries to help them strengthen the linkages between agriculture and nutrition. What we hope will come out of this workshop is that the agricultural sector understands that they need to focus beyond just production and yields and take some responsibility for ensuring that each country has a, a, a steady, sustainable supply of safe and diverse foods that will have then a positive impact on malnutrition, particularly for women and children. 
Tanzania being host country of this workshop had its premier inviting the delegates with anticipating of positive outcomes. Efforts have been undertaken to scale up participation of the private sector in agricultural development, development promotion through public-private partnership arrangements. As part of scaling up nutrition, the government has developed the nutritional, uh, nutritional strategy to guide the implementation of nutrition in interventions so as to ensure that actions to address nutrition are included in the plans and budgets. The overall goal of the workshop was to ensure that nutrition interventions were planned, budgeted for and implemented as part of national agriculture and food security investment plans. One of the areas that member states are being encouraged to invest in is the area of nutrition security, together with food security. And so we are using the CADAP framework as COMESA to encourage our countries to upscale nutrition within the CADAP implementation process. Mm. So what does CADAP actually entail? It entails that countries need to formulate policies, strategies, and investment programs that are comprehensive in nature. The meeting was also part of the wider capacity development process designed to assist countries in enhancing the nutritional impact of national agriculture and food security investment plans. Basically we need to look at all the other public sectors um, through a lens, a nutrition lens if you will, so that we can look to see how we can best um, attack this problem so collaboratively and, uh, and comprehensively. The workshop was organized within the context of food supply and the fight against hunger, which under CADI pillar number three, the key objective was to achieve MDG 1 through agriculture led growth aimed at increasing the supply of affordable nutritious and safe food, improving income of the poor while ensuring overall dietary diversity. One of the CADA pillars. Uh, is precisely about sustainable land and water management. So we have a, you know, that pillar dedicated to looking at, you know, issues of climate change, you know, making sure that, you know, the programs are climate smart and making sure that, you know, indeed countries take responsibility for how they can mitigate whether it is a desertification or whether it is, you know, the unusual, um, you know, um, rainfall and then floods, you know, whether it, whatever the case may be, we have a unit dedicated, you know, to our, to making sure that, you know, climate change issues are taken on board as we talk about agriculture because you cannot deal with agriculture outside of ensuring that there's water, that there are, you know, other inputs which will be or can or are affected by, by climate conditions. Participants to the workshop were at the end of the day expected to produce recommendations and actions plans for strengthening capacities across various institutions which dealt with agricultural issues such as sectors as health and social protection, agriculture, education, trade and industry, as well as finance and economic development planning. Ni lishe bola katika maisha binadamu unasafisha ko na naleta heri katika maeneo ya figo na mapafu na moyo. Moreover, HIV and AIDS and gender issues were taken into account considering their interlinks to nutritional issues. The workshop was the second of its kind after the first hosted in Dakar, Senegal for the West Africa Regional in November 2011.